Hello friends, in this video, I will talk about the important fiber questions based on cathode ray oscilloscope or CRO. The aim of this experiment is to study different waveform in CRO and we have to generate different waveform using the function generator and to study the graph on CRO screen. And these are the typical graphs for sine wave, square wave and this is for the triangular wave and the wavelength is to complete one cycle and this is this will the distance is one wavelength and the time is the time period for completing this one cycle and using this wavelength and time period we can also find out the uh, frequency. In this sine wave the on x axis there is time and y axis that there is voltage and this um, the amplitude is known as the peak voltage bp and from top to bottom this is known as b peak to peak or bpp and the rms voltage can be related with this peak voltage as bp divided by under root 2 or 0.707 of BP is give, uh, gives us the BRMS value and BRMS can be also related to B peak to peak because we we can write in place of BP we can write BPP by 2 so it will be 1 by 2 root 2 of BPP and also we can find out the average value of voltage using this RMS value there is a relation BRMS equal to pi by 2 under root 2 into b average so this is how we can get information from uh, the graphs on the CRO so now we will discuss some important fiber questions related to CRO uh, first question is what is cathode ray oscilloscope so CRO is a common laboratory instrument and that provides accurate time and amplitude measurement of voltage signals over a wide range of frequencies. And what do you mean by the cathode rays? The cathode rays are beam of electrons uh, which are emitted by the heated cathode. Cathode is negative electrode and they are accelerated towards the fluorescent screen. What is a function generator function generator is a signal generator that produces different type of waveforms as uh, at the output like uh, sine wave square wave triangular wave sawtooth wave and it can generate frequencies in a wide range from few hertz to hundred of kilohertz so what are the main components of a cathode ray tube or crt so this is a uh, diagram of CRT. It was used in uh, TV or computer monitor. And the essential components of CRT are electron gun to generate the electron beam, focusing and accelerating anodes to give some acceleration to electrons, and horizontal and vertical and deflection plate to control uh, the direction and the evacuated glass envelope means this whole thing is inside this glass envelope or vacuum and with the screen which is known as phosphorescent screen where we can see the and this uh, beam electron beam on the screen uh, so uh, this is the these are the main components of cathode ray tube so we will discuss in uh, next questions about the different components next question is how is CRO superior to ordinary measuring instruments it is a device which gives the graphical representation of the alternating quantities under examination and it gives very accurate measurements and free from the errors because there are no moving parts during this measurement 
एंड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज विच मेटेरियल आर यूज फॉर मेकिंग द कैथोड सो हाई मेल्टिंग पॉइंट मेटल्स और एलोइज आर यूज फॉर मेकिंग द कैथोड लाइक टंगस्टन सीजियम और आयरन निकल एलोय एट्रेक्टर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वाई वर्टिकल एंड ऑरिजेंटल प्लेट्स आर प्रोवाइडेड इन ए सी आर ओ दीज प्लेट्स आर प्रोवाइडेड टू डिफ्लेक्ट द बीम अकॉर्डिंग टू द इनपुट सिग्नल एक्सप्लेन द इलेक्ट्रॉन गन असेंबली इन ए सी आर टी द इलेक्ट्रॉन गन असेंबली कंसिस्ट ऑफ एन इनडायरेक्टली हीटेड कैथोड ए कंट्रोल ग्रिड सराउंडिंग द कैथोड एंड ए फोकसिंग एनोड एंड एक्सेलरेटिंग एनोड सो वाई इलेक्ट्रॉन गन assembly is provided in a crt the electron gun assembly uh, is to provide a narrow and sharp electron beam which is accelerated towards the phosphor screen next question is why is the grid in a cro provided with a hole in it the hole in a grid of a cro is provided to allow passage of electrons so this is electrons are generated from this cathode and this is grid and there is a hole to pass these electrons what is aquatech it is used as a coating over the interior of a cathode ray tube to collect the secondary electrons this uh, this is the uh, this layer or coating is known as aquatic coating and it helps to prevent the overheating of crt also and it uh, also keep it in the state of electrical equilibrium next question is how the electron beam focus to a fine spot on the face of cathode ray tube and it is done by various set of plates forming a sort of electronic lenses If these plates works as the lenses do in optics so these are electric electronic lenses and by wearing the voltage on the anode plates the spot may be focused what is mean by deflection sensitivity of crt the deflection sensitivity of cro is defined as the vertical deflection of the beam uh, per unit and deflecting voltage what is linear time based generator it provides the output waveform a portion of which exhibits a linear vibration of voltage or current with time what is the function of time based generator in cro so most of the cro applications involve measurement or display of a quantity which varies with respect to time and time based generator is used in cro to produce the sawtooth waveforms and these are also known as sweep generators so next question is what is purpose of triggering circuit in cro trigger is used to make the trace of the waveform on the screen steady or stable without that the waveform is mixed it is free running and it is not possible to make measurements on the frequency or time what is astigmatism control astigmatism control is an adjustment that will provide sharp focus over the screen and this is similar to astigmatism or blurring in the optical lenses or in case of the eyes what is the full form of bnc connector so these are connector are known as the bnc connector and the full form is uh, bennett nail councilman and these these connectors are used in coaxial cable connector at low and rf frequencies and next question is how you see green or red color on crt screen for electron beam so a coating of phosphor material is done on inner surface of the screen and the phosphor material emits lights when it is struck by electron beam and the color depends on the material coated on the screen 
so suppose we see the green dot so green phosphor is used for coating and for that zinc zns uh, zinc sulfide doped with copper aluminum or, or gold is used for green phosphor for blue phosphor zinc sulfide is doped with silver and for red phos uh, red color red phosphor is used y2o2s with some eu doping so what are the applications of cro so cro's are used in the field of telecommunications and radar where they can be used to measure and analyze the characteristics of radio signals and it is used for the measurement of voltage current and phase of different signals and measurement and comparison of frequencies it is used in tv radar and also analysis of engine pressure and for medical applications we can we have also seen different cro's to monitor the heart weight etc and it uh, measures and analyze the electrical signals produced by the human body like ecg etc so thanks for watching this video and if you are new to this channel then please subscribe and share it to other students also and your queries and suggestions are welcome our previous video was viva question on uh, hammond's galvanometer and next video will be on the kirchhoff's current and voltage law kbl and kcl so thanks again